My today's recipe is restaurant style egg chow mein or egg noodles. I will share all the tips and tricks you need to make a delicious non-sticky restaurant style egg noodles. So please do try the recipe and let me know how it works out for you. My channel all about easy to follow, easy to implement, ingredients always displayed on the right and highlighted for each cooking step. If you like my channel, please do not forget to subscribe, share and like. So come follow along and cook with me. We are going to boil the noodles. For that here I have taken 8 cups of water that I have brought to a boil. You need to have enough water so it gives the noodles room to cook properly. So to this water I am going to add some salt and also add one and a half tablespoons of oil. This will really help the noodles stay non-sticky and now I am going to add noodles. I have taken 200 grams of noodles so I have taken thin noodles uh, please do check the instructions at the back of the noodles packet for the time um, it will this noodles that I have taken is going to take me two to three minutes typically that's what the time noodles should take however if you are using slightly thicker needles they may take you four to five minutes now we will let the noodles cook in this boiling water Noodles are now cooked. Now I will turn off the stove and use a strainer to strain the noodle aside. I have strained the noodles. Now we will add some normal temperature water and just wash the noodles this way. What it will help do is it will prevent the noodle from getting cooked even more. So go ahead and do this. Now I will add one tablespoon of oil to this and then mix the noodles well with this oil again this will really help in keeping the noodles non-sticky and lots of times people have a problem that the noodles are not as non-sticky as the restaurant so please follow these tips and tricks and you will have a perfect non-sticky noodles so now we will set the noodle aside and start making our vegetables the first step in making our egg chow mein or egg noodles is to scramble the eggs for that here I have taken one and a half tablespoons of oil. Wait for the oil to be really heated up first. The oil is now hot so here I have beaten four eggs and I have added half a teaspoon of black pepper powder and half a teaspoon of salt. Now I am adding the eggs and now we will scramble the eggs in this oil. The eggs are now ready. Now, now I will set the scrambled eggs aside and start making our noodles. Now I will add another 3 to 4 tablespoons of oil and wait for the oil to be really heated up. Oil is now hot. Now I will add 1 inch of chopped ginger. Also add about 8 to 9 garlic cloves finely chopped. And I'm also adding half a teaspoon of Ajinomoto. If you don't have Ajinomoto or you don't prefer to add that, then you can skip it. Um, in restaurants and for Chinese food, um, Ajinomoto is typically added and gives it a nice flavor. Now we will fry this for about a minute. It's been a minute. Now uh, we will start adding our chopped veggies. So here I have taken 3 4 cup of carrots that I have sliced into thin strips. So all of the vegetables I have sliced um, in long thin strips. 1 cup of carriage, uh, cabbage sorry. and now at a high flame we will saute the vegetables. Also add 1 large onion about 20 grams that I have sliced. So Chinese uh, food is typically always cooked at a really high flame because that helps the vegetables to not get cooked too quickly and also it retains the crunchiness which is there in the noodles so at a high flame we will now cook this for another three to four minutes um, the vegetables which are which take longer to get cooked we will add that now and then later um, i'm going to add capsicum because it takes a shorter time so for three to four minutes at a high flame. Now I will add half a cup of green capsicum and half a cup of red capsicum and also add some 
salt as per taste and we will add half a teaspoon of black pepper powder and now again at a high flame sauteing the vegetables for another three to four minutes now i will add the noodles so go ahead and add all of the noodles and now we, i will add a few other ingredients two tablespoons of dark soy sauce two tablespoons of red chili sauce you can also add green chili sauce and here i have two tablespoons of vinegar and now we will mix the noodles well with everything you can also use another spoon so just to make sure that the noodles don't become too mushy so you can use uh, two spoons and do that so just mix all of the noodles and we will cook this for another two to three minutes at a high flame i've cooked the noodle on a high flame for another three minutes so if you're making veg chow mein or veg noodles you can end it right here but since we are making egg noodles, I'm adding the scrambled eggs and again mix the noodles with the scrambled eggs. Our egg chow mein or egg noodles is now completely ready. You can see how non-sticky the noodles are. So please do try the recipe this way and I'm sure you'll love it. Thank you so very much for watching my channel.